Hey, what's going on guys? Pug coming back at you with another video. Bit of a short one today. We managed to find a Celebrations box at my local Walmart for a really good price. These are only $20 in store. So I figured, you know what, let's go ahead and pick this up, see what we get out of it. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be wondering, hey, why'd you go with the Sylveon one instead of the Charizard box, right? Well, I actually already have the Charizard promo because I got it from 10 back when Celebrations first came out. Of course, uh, this box is from the second print run where it just got released. Oh my god, this thing's so hard to get open. Jeez. Yeah, so I was like, I kind of avoided the Charizard one. I don't really need it. Uh, obviously, I'm just kind of buying it for the promo and the content at this point. I will say it's kind of cool that in the tin, you didn't get the jumbo card, and you do get the jumbo card in the box, so pretty nice looking. Also, I already have a Charizard box from the first print run. Uh, that is in my sealed collection, which I will not be opening. So, just don't really need it. Um, checking out some packs we got in here. Put that promo to the side. What do we even got in here? So, I know we got... We got Fusion Strike, Falling Skies, and of course the four Celebrations packs. So we'll start off with Fusion Strike because I have the least hope for that set. You guys know how I feel about it. I mean, Fusion Strike is a sleeper set. It's got some awesome cards in it, but I mean, I just had horrendous luck with it. Maybe today that will change with this one pack. I highly doubt it, but we'll see. Go four from the back. Who knows, maybe we'll get that really cool Gengar. So we go into a Metal Energy, Dancer, Pangoro, Graplocked, Zerua, there's Shelter, Caterpie, Thriller, Shinx, Victini, and an on Hollow Veltal. That's about what we're expecting. So, no disappointment there. And we got the Sylveon pack art from Evolving Skies out of the Sylveon box. That's kind of cool. Let's see how this goes for us. Yeah, I uh, so I went in Walmart not too long ago with my wife and the girls. <clears throat> and we walked past the section, they had this big display with all these in here and it was completely stocked, like completely full. And I just, you know, I decided to pass on it. Didn't really want to pick one up. And then we had to go back in. And so I was like, you know, I'll walk by, I'll, I'll grab one for some content. Literally every Charizard box was gone. It was nothing but Sylveon left, which was fine with me. As we get into the Water Energy, Skip Loom, Elemental Badge, Spirit Mask, Cutie Fly, there's an Eevee, Psyduck, Timpole, Ubat, Flapple, and an Odd Hollow Pinsir. Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty obvious that uh, everybody's always going to fanboy over Charizard. It's always going to be a thing. Speaking of which, let me know if you guys have seen the Charizard UPC in stores yet. I have not. I think that's out as of the timing of this video. Uh, I did not pre-order it. It's going to be, for me, it's going to be one of those things. If I see it, awesome. If I don't, then whatever. First time opening Celebrations on the channel. Let's see what we got here. We got Hello, Zekrom. Oh, nice. I am not mad at that. We got the Umbreon Gold Star. Now, I know you guys haven't seen this, but since the channel only somewhat recently started, I actually already have this card, but I'm also, I mean, I'm, you know, I'm happy to open it again. I'm Rion Gold Star, definitely one of the, uh, one of the bigger cards in the Celebration subset. Can't be upset about opening that one. Put you right there. Nice. It's actually way better results than I was expecting to get, I'm going to be honest with you. My last couple times having open celebrations, uh, it's either been no hits or like, a, you know, just a really subpar hit out of the uh, subsection. And, you know, they say that this is a reprint, but in case you guys haven't noticed, these are all old school code cards. These are not newer code cards, so... Pretty interesting. Crowd on Lugia. Hey! This is another one I actually don't have. Got the Gardevoir uh, Delta Species card. Really cool. Not too bad at all. This For me, this is a cool card to open because it's like, you know, th this is a card that came out during a time when I wasn't collecting. So I, I think the Delta Species, that's a really cool concept for uh, a card. 
Pokemon being a different type than what they traditionally are. Of course, this Gardevoir is a fire type, which is pretty cool. And then we got the old school Pikachu in here. I'm not going to bother sleeving this up. I have a million copies of this card. We'll just sort of set that over there. Yeah, uh, when Celebrations first came out, I, I went kind of crazy. I, yeah, I, I opened quite a bit of Celebrations. Actually, ooh, I'm Brian. Don't go nowhere, buddy. Pretty cool card. Yeah, um, opened quite a bit of it. I have almost every promo card from Celebrations. I think the only ones I'm missing are the um, Zacian Level X. I don't have that one. And I don't have uh, Dragapult Prime. Those are the only ones I'm missing. Got two packs left. Let's see if we can continue this Lux streak. There's no way we get a hit out of this one, too. Yeah, I mean, so I'm gonna be, I, I don't count these as hits. If, if you've ever opened Celebrations before, you know that every, every card's a hollow minimum. And then, like, the regular Vs that are in this set, like Zacian, Zamazenta. <clears throat> I guess technically they're hits. I do not count them as hits, so they're maybe you know valued at a dollar or something like that. But anyway, getting into the last one, I I don't even care what's in this pack. We, you know we got the Umbreon Gold Star. It's a really good card to open. Uh, it would be lovely if we could get the uh, the base set Zard. Obviously, I'd also love to see the the secret rare Mew. But you know what? I think we did pretty well. Last pack, we've got Evoltol, Palkia. Hey, that's actually another one I don't have. This is probably my luckiest celebration opening ever. I'm, I'm glad I decided to film this. We got Team Magma's Groudon. Not too bad at all. It's a really cool looking card. And, I, and again, I don't count that flying Pikachu V. But here are our hits we didn't get anything out of fusion strike we didn't get anything out of our one pack of evolving skies but out of our celebrations packs we did very very well Let's see if i can zoom in and give you guys a better look yeah not too bad at all got the umbreon gold star i, I would say is the highlight of the video the gardevoir ex delta species and team magnus groudon well, that's going to be it for this one. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you had as much fun as I did. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you guys have seen celebrations in stores. Anyway, have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.